and the answer to that is yes and no. And if you do manage to have some hair growth, it will be achieved at a very slow rate on average, ladies. Why? Due to potential breakage. Keep that in mind. Due to potential breakage. Okay, we've discussed this on various videos. When your hair is exposed, potential breakage can and will occur. Now I'm bringing up this subject because there are some ladies out there who say that protective styling is simply not for them. That they can grow their hair without it. And for some of them that it's just simply not their cup of tea. Now, that may be true in some cases regarding these ladies growing their hair without protective styling. But in most cases, the average black woman who does not use protective styling as part of a longer, healthier hair growth regimen will find it extra difficult, extra difficult to grow her hair. Okay, especially if her goal is to get to waist length. And that goal gets even more difficult and even non-existent if she dreams of fairy tale mythical hair lengths, which is booty length and beyond. So the longer she wants to grow her hair, the more difficult it will be to get to that hair length goal without protective styling. So my advice to any woman of color with dry prone afrotation hair, whether it is relaxed, whether it is natural, whether it is biracial, if your dream is to grow waist length, booty length, or just simply reach your personal hair length goals much faster and with less headaches, use protective styling. Now, a while ago, I made a video titled Protective Styles Are Not Boring. And in this video, I showed you several ways to spice up your protective styles. So please, ladies, watch that video again so you can first see the beauty of protective styles and that it is not something only your grandma will wear, okay? Because there's a misconception about protective styling that they're boring, that, oh, th that's something grandma will wear. No. Watch the video, okay? Protective styles are not boring. Watch that video. And the video will also show you how you can decorate them and style them to beautify them even more. With that said, if you are a big fan of styles with tons of volume and tons of height, but your hair is still not at that level, okay, there's a lot of ladies out there who dream of having a lot of body in their hair, a lot of volume, a lot of height, but if your hair, again, still not at that level, then this is even more reason to stick with your protective styling until you reach that level. That way you will easily be able to wear your hair in beautiful twist outs, in beautiful braid outs, and enjoy all of the height and volume you dreamed about. But with protective styling, ladies, okay? Only if you stick with your protective styling, and I cannot reiterate that enough. Again, ladies, some, which means very few black women out there may be able to achieve longer hair without protective styles, but for the average, meaning the majority of black women, including myself, this will not be the case. We need to use protective styles to guarantee longer, healthier hair as we use our Shima oils to keep our hair moisturized, as we use our Shima Girl Silk Scarves to lock in our Shima oils overnight and keep our protective styles in place, as we practice gentle handing with our fingers and hair combs and brushes to continue to create more protective styles during our Shima hair growth journeys. So at the end of the day, Shima Girls, protective styling is extremely important if that's a big word if you truly want your hair to finally grow very very long thank you shima girls i'll be seeing you in the next video